okay guys hi everyone you're welcome to my channel once again and in today's video I want to quickly show my Nigerian guys my people in Nigeria how they can easily buy Tron by themselves without going through a third party to help them get it and uh, the site you'll be using is called Roku and this is a Nigerian exchange that came out recently and their services are top-notch their prices are very very competitive and all you need to do is just create a free account with them and you can start doing business of buying your cryptocurrencies especially Tron which you need so I'm already at their site I'm going to drop the link to connecting to the site at the bottom of the video so you can go out there click on the link sign up for a free account and start buying cryptocurrencies especially Tron so in this video we are going to be dealing on how to create your free Roku account then fund your Roku wallet with Naira and then use it to buy Tron on their exchange so uh, all you need to do like you can see I'm at the signing page here but because I'm a new person I'll just look at the bottom you see don't have an account sign up here so once I click that it brings this create an account page for, for me so all you need to do is just put in your first name your last name your email address your phone number create uh, a password create a password confirm your password and hit sign up for an account once you do that you've created an account simple and easy so I've already created an account that I'm going to use so all I need to do is come back to this page and sign in so let me quickly sign into the account I've created uh, so, okay. let me enter my email address Uh, enter my password so I've entered my email address and my password and I click sign into account so it's signing me in now just wait for some minutes so here is my Roku account as you can see I have like 14 Naira inside it balance uh, I sent some money earlier and I bought some trunks for myself earlier on in the day. So I have like 14 naira left over. So once you sign into your account, now it's very imperative that at this moment in time, once you first of all sign up for an, a free account, you need to verify the account. And one of the ways you can do that is by entering your bank account details. Once you enter your bank account details, you will be asked to verify that bank account by, suppl by, by supplying your BVN number. Once you, do, once you supply your BVN number, it will, it will remove any limit that may, be restrict, that may be restricting you from buying some amount of crypto. For instance, if your account you created, you supplied your uh, bank account details, but you did not verify that bank account details with your BVN it means that your 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 account will be unverified and it will own, it will limit you it will restrict you to just uh, doing business in a day to the tune of 20,000 naira only what it implies is if you need to buy crypto beyond 20,000 naira in a day you need to verify that your bank account that you supplied by simply adding your BVN number and as simple as that once they verify it, it takes just like less than 10 seconds once it's verified that your BVN that you supplied is correct your account will be unlocked so that you can buy any amount of crypto you want in a day so once you've done that the next thing you need to do is to deposit money into this your account so as you can see on the dashboard here i have the deposit i have buy sell then i have withdraw so what i want to do now i want to load this my roku account i want to load it with some amount of money so that i can buy crypto especially tron so 
as you can see i have several cryptocurrencies in the wallet here which i can buy or sell or do business with so i'm interested in tron so all i need to do right now is i want to buy tron so i'll first of all need to top up this my account with money with naira so what i do is i click i will click on deposit then it will ask me how much do you want to deposit i will enter for this example i will just say i want to deposit 500 naira i'll say proceed with deposit then it will tell me my deposit amount 500 naira processing fee zero so i'll click proceed then it will ask me how would you like to deposit i'll say bank transfer now it will give you your own unique banking details that is unique to your roku account which you could pay into from your normal general bank account and once you deposit money to this specified account bank banking account that have been created for you your roku account will be deposited with the exact amount that you put inside so for me i want you to note something it will always provide two unique banking accounts for you one from providence bank the second one from wema bank but it is highly recommended that you that you use your bank account that comes from providence bank that one goes very very fast and it's almost instantaneous so what i need to do i'll just copy down this my banking details and i'll go ahead and deposit money into it and see what happens next so give me a sec i'll be right back let me top up this account with some money like 500 naira so i'll pause so guys i'm back i've deposited i've just transferred 500 naira to this my roku's specific roku account the providers i use the providers bank uh, account and uh, let's see if my 500 naira is already in my account so you click on return to wallet as you can see on the screen i now have 514 naira inside my roku account as balance so next thing i want to do now now that i have money in my roku uh, wallet in my roku account the next thing i want to do is i want to buy crypto i want to buy tron so i click on buy slash sell so it will ask me it will bring this up instant buy or instant sell i want to buy i'm not selling so i click instant buy so it will ask me which digital currency do you want to buy in this case um, i want to buy tron so i'll click on tron that is your trx that's your tron i'll click on it it will ask me how much would you like to buy in this case i want to buy 500 naira worth of tron so i will enter the amount since it's already denoted in naira you can see ngn that is nigerian naira so i will just enter 500 and I will click proceed with purchase. Now it will bring this confirmed purchase of Tron. It will tell you one Tron at the moment is worth 12 Naira. You spend 500 Naira. They will collect a service charge of 10 Naira. And you get 40.822.75 Trons. I will say accept. Now it will ask me to enter my authorization pin it is bringing this pin here for me i want you to know this it is bringing this pin here now for me because i am doing the transaction from their app if i was using my desktop pc to do this transaction it wouldn't ask me to put this my authorization pin instead it will send an authorization code to your email address so you you will need to go to your email address, copy out the authorization code they have sent you, and now enter it into your authorization pop-up that you will see in front of you. Then you confirm transaction. In this case, 
it is asking for my authorization pin so i want to provide my authorization pin so give me a second so i have entered my authorization pin so that i'll click complete so i'll wait for it now i'll wait for it it will tell you purchase successful you click on continue if you check i bought 500 naira watch of tron and i now still have a balance of 14 naira because i had 14 514 514 naira in, in my wallet when i topped up i've used up 500 naira so i have 14 naira still left in it so if i go to click down you see my tron initially i had some trons here and i bought some additional trons in it so you, in my tron there now you can see that i have 94.1237 trons i have bought trons now i have trons i have bought trons with naira i have tron in this wallet so what do i have to do if i want to send this tron to someone i can send it to somebody if i want to invest in a in a business that uses tron all i need to do is send the tron from this my wallet to the investment platform or if there's any other tron wallet that you have that you want to fund with tron you can buy your tron here and use this your roku wallet to send the tron there so if i click on that tron there it tells me what do i want to do you want to send tron or you want to receive tron so it's left for you to to know what you want to do so basically this is how easy it is for you as a nigerian to buy tron very simple very easy using naira so my video for today is complete i hope uh, you now see how easy for you it is as a nigerian to buy tron directly by yourself using your naira from your bank account very simple very easy guys thank you and i hope you enjoyed this video i'll see you next time right and um, for me right now i say cheers peace have a very good day god bless you